What a game, Liverpool 4, Tottenham 3. That game had, had goals, had drama, it had... It had pretty much everything you'd want in a football match. First half, Liverpool were superb, but then Kane gets one back, and then it changed the whole reflection of the game. And then Son gets one back, and then you think Spurs are right back in it. Then they get the equaliser through Richarlison. Then you think they could maybe go on and, 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 and nick it. But then they do the spursiest thing as possible and Jota goes in and, and gets the fourth and wins it. But I I think Tottenham can be proud of their team because when you're 3-0 down, you're expecting to get beat about 5 or 6 nil when it's to Liverpool. Because on their day, when, when, when they're at, Anfield, they can destroy anybody. And I think they, 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 that's, a, that's a victory that could get them the top four. Because if that was Liverpool of, say, maybe like when they were losing to teams like Forest, Bournemouth, they probably would have capitulated and maybe even have conceded a fourth to lose the game. But I think they still probably won't get top four, but with how weird this season's been, you can't rule out anything. And I think Ryan Ryan Mason's got a bit of a tune out of Tottenham because before he was there, they were struggling to... they were, they were struggling to keep out goals and they were struggling to score goals as well. But since he's been there, he, he's, he, he's cut out a bit of defensive problems and, and he's made them score more goals. Whether he'll get the job on a permanent yet, I, I still don't think so, but you never know. And um, I think that's probably it for Tottenham's top four chances. I think Liverpool's top four chances are back on, but... The only way they get it now is if either one of Newcastle or United bottle it, which I think it's highly unlikely because both Newcastle and United have favourable run-ins um, between now and the end of the season. United's only hard game is like um, Brighton away and um, Newcastle's only hard game is um, Arsenal at home. And, yeah... Leave me your thoughts on the game in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys for another video soon. What a game. Still can't believe how much drama there was. But have a lovely rest of your Sunday. And I'll see you guys soon.